Okay, one of the things you're working on this week is something called finish. And the purpose of finish is to get your dog from in front of you into your left hand side in the heel position. It can be done in two ways. One is called the right finish where your dog will walk along your right hand side around your body and then come in to your uh, into heel position. The other uh, is when the dog will come in on your left hand side and pivot his body so that he is in heel position. Uh, perhaps the, the right hand side is a little easier so that's where we're going to begin. We can teach this in a couple of ways. One is using a hand touch. So we'll start by having our dog touch. <laughs> Clearly he didn't have to move very much for that. My dog is lazy at this moment. But let's just get him to move a bit more. Touch. Yes. And incrementally you're going to increase the distance your dog has to travel until your dog is traveling all the way around your body. At some point you're going to have to go from having him touch your right hand, flip out your right hand and leave your left hand there for him to touch. Like this. Touch. Yes. The other way of teaching it is by a lure. Um, and of course the difficulty with using a lure is that once you start to use it, you have to fade it out. So if you decide that you're going to use a lure, make sure that you only do it a couple of times, maybe three times, and then you fade it out. So taking your treat, Red Rover, this way, you get him to come part of the distance, yes, and give him the treat. And then. You can get him to go a little bit further this way and switch it eventually, yes, and give him the treat. But as I say, you don't want to do that very often because you may get a dog who only does it when the lure is available to him. And of course, in the rally competition, that's not how you do things. So eventually, what you want is a dog that can do finish, yes. Now, if you want your dog to be a little bit more bouncy than Red Rover was just then, you can work on not having him come to a stop when he gets into heel position, but instead go into a walking. You ready? This way. Finish. Heel. Yes. So that he has to catch up with you. Uh, that took him by surprise that time, but next time I do it, he would probably be anticipating, wait a minute, I better get around there quickly because she may be going on without me if I'm not careful. So those are some ways that you can uh, help work with your dog getting him into a right finish.